Hey YouTube, what is going on you guys? This is Sterling from Lego Supreme Please and I'm here with build number one of the ice cream machine. Let me show you the box real quick. Alright, here's the front of the box. It's ages 8 through 14, 70804 ice cream machine. 344 pieces. Comes with one micromanager and three minifigures. This is a two-in-one, and I have reviewed both in this video, so check out both. Skip, skip ahead if you want to see the actual ice cream truck. Here's a really close shot of the minifigures. You get Ice Cream Mike, Ice Cream Joe, and Cardio Carry. We take a look at the back here. You see a wonderful shot of the nice ice cream truck. That's probably my f more favorite build even Alright, let's take a look at the instruction manuals. The first two, you construct the ice cream machine. This one. You also build the creeper. This is, I'll tell you how many steps it is. Uh, 14 steps. And the second one, we actually construct the machine, is, construct this. Actual like 47 steps, and it's quite long 67 pages. So, it's 67 pages to do the I mean, one and two to do the first build. And this entire second booklet here is just the entire truck. So, yeah, that's it for the manuals. First minifigure here we have Ice Cream Joe. I really, really like Ice Cream Joe and Ice Cream Mike. I think they did a really good job. So, they have little uniforms on. Little aprons and blue shirts. They have an ice cream cone there. And they each have a name tag. So, in white pants as well. Back printing. She has this lighter colored hair. This is her first face. And this is, oh, I thought she had a double-sided face. Well, here's Ice Cream Mike. Same thing. He has a different type apron. Hers is a lower one, only around the waist. His goes over his chest. Name tag, that different cone, and also white pants. I like his um like chef hat printing on the back no double sided head that's the two ice cream guys so next is cardio carry it looks like an exercise nut and she walks by i guess the ice cream stand um and has to debate whether or not to get anything so here's her torso and legs she has like an ipod um leggings and tights and black shoes her back printing she has a really long ponytail going and it's dark brown her face is pretty nice and she's got a headband on for exercise and this is the face I really like it's like a face which she will make if she's deciding whether or not to eat something with fat in it <laughs> and her back printing. So those are all three minifigures. Next little item you get is this really really nice um, micromanager. I like it because it doesn't have any of those ratcheting legs. I don't really like adjusting those backwards knee bent ratcheting legs. They're always unstable and get off balance easily. This one doesn't have it. It just it's jet propelled I guess. See the little exhaust. It's a little cube shaped. It's got the lasers sticking out. One protruding here, there. And then you see the missiles in there. These are ratcheting claws. They go left to right. And the you can rotate the claw as well. And you can grip things. Uh, 
This has a really amazing feature. Let me demonstrate that to you right now. Okay, I'll do that again. Alright, I switched angles for a better uh, demo. And what you do is... So, it, it's a triple shooting missile, missile fire. Uh, you have this here, it's like a clip, or a magazine, and it holds three rounds. You leave the bottom one open, and in this creeper you have a spacer where you stick this here, load it, and you make sure it goes down, so there it's ready, and the knob faces towards you. And you can proceed to fire. And when it falls in this place, it falls down for to fire the next one. So that is the really spectacular three firing missile micromanager. So here we are finally taking a look at the actual ice cream machine flying contraption. It's really, really... Uh, unique, that's what I could say. It's pretty shocking. Looks like it's a piece together, you know, the ice cream truck like you uh, broke it apart and reassembled it into a flying ice cream looking machine. It is, if you like ice cream machines, this is really something to look at. You really want this set. You use so many unique Lego elements in it, it's just wonderful. So let's just go over it. Um, there is quite a few stickers, but they help to add really good detail, such as this, the SP91056, this star pattern up there, and these octane cones here, and the menus, the flavors. And if you pay close attention here to the stickers, you can see that those are actual combinations. The truck comes with um, this tube of green and blue and I think those are actual flavors uh, you can tell here there's blue ice cream and this that and green ice cream and this that and um, they're being circulated out through these tubes um, you can imagine this thing is going around playing a lot of ice cream music because you have these loudspeakers here and these loudspeakers are a really unique color Lime, I've never seen that green. It's even lighter than the lime green. It's like a creamy add into it. Um, so, yeah, it's things popping with pink all over and just really, really interesting. It's got a place where uh, you can have one person controlling it back here, the actual flight, which I think it is um, Ice Cream uh, Joe. So, you can stand her in there. And that's what it looks like basically in the cockpit of the machine. The wheel. And, um,. This is the back of the cone here. This is vanilla scoop. So you stand her in there. Alright, Joe's in there. And she's at the wheel. Each side features... Um, it's completely full of windows. It's only open to the back. I wish maybe they could have closed it, but... This is how it is. It's open. Um, the giant cone sits on top. It can angle like this. Up or down. And um, the box shows it spraying like a mist or gas or something out. I don't know if it's, it doesn't seem like water. It looks like gas or air or something. Um, each wing has two tires that rotate. Each wing also has, I hope you noticed, unique looking popsicle missiles they put their each uh, foot fire foot fire missiles pretty nice use those in build two um, you just put them in the freeze box so um, I guess essentially you can put them in there to keep them cold too this would be like a little refrigeration thing and um, those just go there this is detail of the wings. Each wing has a cone. 
You get a total of six new crown pieces with this. You get six of these light tan cones. Six. Um, you get two white ice creams, one blue, and two orange. And I don't know if I mentioned the green. So yeah, you get a lot, kind of a lot of food in here. So you can actually like when you have the next build up, take off all the cones and um, serve a whole bunch of cones to many figures if you line them up. These are like weird details. You um, double up the cones like that and put this yellow ice cream on there, orange or whatever. You have a small little windshield. Oh, you have um in here the little vent that's printed. And this is a place where um, Ice Cream Mike or any of the minifigures can stand here and control the, I don't know, maybe these launch or something or control the ice cream. And then you can have Cardio Carrie pictured in here. So you can stick her in there. Yeah, looks pretty nice. I really like it. I like build number two more. And um, I just like all the unique elements a lot. So, really nice flying unit. So, that is pretty much it. Build number one. Check out build number two. You won't regret it. Alright, guys. Check out the build number two. Bye. So, right into build number two here. We see the ice cream actual truck. This is a really, really nice ice cream truck. Superb detail on it. Uh, from the sides, you have two windows. You, you can have two people serving at once. So here's Ice Cream Mike on this side. And you can have Ice Cream Joe on the other side. Um, it's a little out of scale. If you notice how short she is to the window. It's a little short. She's a little short. So that's alright. Um, go over the menu. Flavors. It's a sticker. You see all the combinations there. One blue, two pink, three pink, three blue, one green, one blue, a little bit of pink, uh, blue, two green, and just all the combinations. Green, a little bit of blue and pink. And it's the same exact thing on the other side. You have a little bit of stickers on here, but it's not a big deal because they really bring it to life. Ice cream, octane, little ice cream symbols, and clever octane swirls there too. The overall pink color is really good for an ice cream truck as well. You have a massive cone on top. It's out of frame here. Yeah, that's, that's it. There's actually four little cones mounted all around, and that's a pretty nice piece to have. You actually get six in total, I believe. Yeah, six. Uh, or five. Can't remember. But yeah, the cone, um, cone decoration is really, really nice. You have a yellow and vanilla on each side, and another yellow and vanilla on the other side. And you can take them off if you want and serve a whole bunch of cones, line a whole bunch of minifigures up, serve a whole bunch of cones. You can, you know, switch off the top and just peg on there. It's a useful piece for making ice cream and Lego. And, um, little four little rubber wheels. This is what it looks like from the front. You have this nice curved piece here with a big ice cream sticker. A lot of detail on there. You have the loud speakers here with their very unique rare color show you that. Take a look at that color. I don't know if it's the first time ever used, but it's the first time I've ever had anything in this tone. It's the uh, Business Kitty or Unikitty has the stud for its head. This color, really rare. You get two of these. And these are the megaphone loudspeakers. Play the ice cream music. You can angle them out. They show them slightly at an angle. Um, this is not the set number, believe it or not, SP91056. The set number is, um, what is it again? 
70804, but it's like one of the first times I've ever noticed that it's not the actual set number. Get a little bar here, headlights, this nice um, decorative star sticker with some stripes. There's some big mirrors on each side. And here's back to ice cream Mike's side. And it says ice cream above here in that nice font, octane, and um, octane swirl, octane emblems, and really, really nice. This the flavor sticker on the back. You have an unusual looking ice cream vehicle. Um, I don't really like the gap there. The gap I think is a little unnecessary, but you do get some um, unique flat uh, pink tiles and then also back here you have uh, four little green dot things for decoration and you do have tail lights under there those little red things tail lights just an unusually designed back pretty nice you can see the cone as well so that is it for the outside of the nice ice cream truck so you pop this off tire top unit take a better look at that you get a drill piece in a cone color which works wonderfully as a cone because it's so cone shaped and it actually has that crunchy looking detail on it big scoop of vanilla loudspeaker detail green scoops they look like almost um, really really nice roof okay this is how it looks like without the roof down in there is where either one can drive it ice cream Joe or Mike this is a really neat feature here um, this is like a little freeze box and you have a little two popsicles in there two of them down in there uh, you sell one to Cardio Carrie. Uh, she doesn't choose ice cream. She goes for the free spot, less fat. And um, this is her face when she's worried about fat. Wondering if she, she have it. Mm -hmm. you know. And then you can take this out. I don't know if you're supposed to, but you can. And that is a printed piece. It is a sewer cap, but it's a vent ventilation for this little refrigeration unit. You can store two popsicles in there. You got to get them right or else the lid won't close. I like translucent. Um, the doors here is like you can make this into an oven or whatever, but I like when the door is translucent. Um, you can also, there are also mailboxes when they're all solid. So there's that. See, they comfortably fit in there with a little bit of space to serve out the window. Back here are two ice cream machines, dispensers, and a few uh, knocked her loose. And if you take it up, take a look like this, you can see good with the spigots come down, and then you have a prep area right there where you can set up and make cones. Yet one rare green ice cream. Check this out. Looks like peas. But that's a unique color there. First time I've ever had it. You can prep your cones there. Cone prep. There's a peg. You just peg it there. Pegged on. And yeah, very, very, very nice. Really nice two in one. It's my only two in one so far. I want to get um, the castle looking one, the, tr the toilet one. And to all of them eventually so yeah i hope you like this review of the part two and all the parts I'm, i've done uh thanks for checking out my review check out my other videos i just made a playlist please like subscribe comment share all that good stuff and yeah pick this up when you see it it's amazing you will really really like it thanks for watching see you next time guys bye